more time, Ryan Norman. Good evening, people. Yes, I have a notebook, don't worry about it. <laughs> so prom's next week, yeah. Everybody's gonna go down to the shore, have a good time, go down to Wildwood, you know, keep going before they hit Avalon. Eventually end up in a place, you know, called Stone Harbor. Yeah, it's a good place. If you, have, if you don't know about Stone Harbor, it's basically where white people go when they're tired of diversity. <laughs> like, they're the only people, I went, I was the only black person in Stone Harbor, you know? Yeah, started freaking people out. Like, it's kind of like that moment in Lord of the Rings when the Hobbits leave the Shire and go to the bar and everybody else is like, well, I've seen pictures, I've heard of Hobbits, but you know, I've never actually seen them. You know? That's what it was like. <laughs> and I'm walking down the street, people are crossing the street, There's small children on balconies taking pictures, like, Mom, he's brown! What is going on? Yeah. <laughs> the National Geographic people on the corner, like, filming a documentary. As you can see, the Negro is not his native land. He seems lost and bewildered. The local news starts freaking out. They're like, oh, they're on to us. We've been hiding out in Stone Harbor all this time. They're on the coming. They're going to bring their, their sweatpants and the rap music. So, uh, so, um, you know, let's switch the topic up. Yeah. They say black people are always late. That's false. <laughs> black people are always on time, just not the same time that everybody else abides by. <laughs> black people, we operate on something called CP time. Yeah. It's out there to turn to color people time. Yeah. yeah. I told my friend when I was, when I was writing this joke, I said, hey, uh, Joe, I think I'm going to write a joke about, about CP time. He goes, well, uh, well, yeah, that's how white people sound to me. I mean, well, uh, well, what, what's CP time? And I said, I said, Joe, you know, it's about a half hour after everybody else's time. <laughs> whenever there's an event, it's like daylight savings, except it only applies to like events and outings. You know, whenever there's an event, all the black people are pouring about 20, 30 minutes after all the white people. You know, because we're late. But not real. <laughs> This is bad, don't ever do this. Don't ever do what I'm doing. You know. I'm gonna talk about some more some, some more black people things. I've noticed <laughs> in my research, black people, we don't know flavors. We know colors. <laughs> There's a big difference. Go hang out with your black friends, you know, just ask them, you know, ask them what color Gatorade you're drinking. Red, blue, yellow. <laughs> he doesn't ever say like fruit punch, glacier freeze, lemon lime. Like no. That's not how it works. You're sitting down at lunch eating a bag of Doritos, and you're like, oh, hey, Tom Rome, what color is that? Red. <laughs> Guarantee he doesn't say nacho cheese. You know? Just do it. Next time you're at your friend's house, you know, your, your black friend, you have to have at least one, you know, this old. <laughs> Next time you're there, you know, you can walk in, you know, just go into his fridge and open up. Ask, him, ask, you know, ask your mom what color Kool-Aid is in there. You know, he won't say grape, he'll say purple. That's how, that's how, <laughs> that's how it works, you know? So I got an early graduation gift from my uncle. You know, he got me a GPS. Like I, I get lost a lot. I'm, I'm bad at directions. That part about black people is true. We don't know how to get anywhere. But he got me a GPS, and I, I don't think he knew at the time, or else he wouldn't have got it. But my GPS must have been manufactured by the KKK, because um, it's the most racist thing I've ever run into. You know? my, but you know, I didn't know at first. I was like, all right, all right. just driving. It's like go three blocks and turn left. Beer trucker. <laughs> Every now and then when I'm driving, it'll start directing me like liquor stores to buy 40s. I'm sure your friends are outside. <laughs> I'll get in, I'll tell the boy teacher, I'll get, hey GPS, uh, take me to the library. We'll go, beep, beep. Did you mean crown fried chicken? <laughs> 